ladies and gentlemen, welcome once again to Chikara's podcast, A Go Go, your weekly dose of Chikara's brand of pro wrestling. My name is Gavin Loudspeaker. Today on the Go Go, we're going to be taking a look at the tag team known as the Throwbacks, Dasher Hatfield and Mr. Touchdown. This weekend, ladies and gentlemen, in Syracuse, New York, Dasher Hatfield will get a title shot against Chikara Grand Champ Eddie Kingston. It's a huge opportunity for him, and Mr. Touchdown will begin his quest for the Young Lions Cup. And we also know that they also have the three points necessary for tag team title contention, and the throwbacks will be cashing in those three points next month. This puts them in an extremely unique position here in Chikara. They could conceivably win all the Chikara titles at the same time. Let's take a look right now at how Dasher Hatfield and Mr. Touchdown got their first point. Mike Quagmush and Gavin Loudspeaker calling the action for you. The throwbacks in their new incarnation, Dasher Hatfield with Mr. Touchdown Mark Angelicetti. Opposite the demonic duo of O'Barrian and Cobalt, the Batiri. The throwbacks look like they are hot off the griddle for this match right here. Getting in the ring with the demonic duo known as the Batiri. Of course, points in play towards Chikara's Tag Team Championship. That's right, our current no, reigning champion. Whoa, look at that cascade. Possibly up there. a power bomb. No, over into a sunset flip. Right through Dasher now. Reverse pickup at the ankle. Takes him back to the ropes. Dasher. Whoa. What a back body drop by Dasher Hatfield. The second incredible back body drop I've seen tonight. Or this afternoon. Right around to the back elbow to the midsection of Kodama. Looking for Crucifix, Hatfield's got him. Spinning combination, couldn't keep him down though, two count only. Did a good job exposing the shoulder blades. Hatfield now trying to incite a reaction. Whoa! Nicely done. Hey, this isn't Dasher's first baseball game. He Out knows what he's doing in there. Mr. Touchdown. Foul ball, foul demon. Indeed. Have you ever got a oh, there's a there tag, Mr. Touchdown, tagging himself in here. He's kind of the quarterback of this team, calling the plays, calling the shots. Oh, right off the ring apron, right there. 
Dasher was looking for his baseball slide, I think, and Mr. Touchdown stole his thunder. Mr. Touchdown going into the John Madden playbook, doing what he needs to do to get the win here. Here comes Dasher. There's the baseball slide to both members of the Batiri. Nice teamwork here by this, the newest incarnation of the throwbacks here, working well together. Of course, packed house here in Chicago Ridge. Absolutely, I saw the bring out more racks of chairs here. It's incredible. The Chikarmi of the Chicago land area out in full force. Look at this. Chikara oh. loves Chicago, but right here, it looks like Kodama getting some punishment right there in the ropes by Mr. Touchdown, a backbreaker. Hooks that leg. Kodama, though, very tenacious is Kodama kicking out of these high impact maneuvers. It just shows how insane these Batiri members are. Body slam. Mr. Touchdown with a little bit of agility drill there. Drops that. And knee right to, right in the face of Kodama. He exposed his kneecap there. Absolutely. Pulled the knee pad away. Then he dropped the knee. It's a veteran move from a guy who doesn't have what I would consider to be veteran experience, but obviously only an accomplished two-sport athlete. Well, only a few matches under his belt, like you said, but Mr. Touchdown definitely makes up for that with his intensity in that ring. There's the tag. Oh, Barry and tag. Look at this. Slick teamwork. The Batiri. The Batiri. Some of the smoothest teamwork we have here in Chikara. These two guys. These guys. Almost what? like it's like a pair of separated Siamese twins. That's exactly what I was going to say, Gavin. That's crazy that you said that. Yeah, but maybe, maybe you had a Siamese dream about it. Maybe I did. Ah, oh, there's a Billy Corgan reference in there somewhere. I can't put it together. Well, we're in now. Chicago. I did see them headline Lollapalooza. It was something I else. I've seen him live. He's smashing. <laughs> Great Headbutt. looking flying. Yeah, he just came flying like a rocket right at Mr. Touchdown. And two count, Mr. Touchdown. If you ever hear them grunting and groaning at ringside, you might think the Bateri are not effective communicators, but boy, does their Twitter account tell another story, That's Gavin. Definitely true. These guys do not shut up when it comes to antagonizing Sarah Del Rey, the queen of wrestling. I think, the only English, I think the only English I've ever heard them speak is follow us on Twitter. Mm -hmm. The French suplex there, sometimes known as a gourd buster, the face first drop by Kodama. And those are right hands, right to the skull. Greco-Roman right hands. Is that Hooks what they were? Hooking the leg, a two count only. Mr. Touchdown in, in incredible shape here. Multi-sport athlete, football being his calling card. Wonder if it's any good at ping pong. There you see old Barry, and with a knife edge chop, Mr. Touchdown trying to fire back. You can see he's got those those gloves. Might be good for receptions, but they're not good for knife edge chops. Interceptions, maybe even. Even interceptions. Definitely things ending in eption. Chest first into that. Whoa! Turn buckle, beautiful. Ah! Follows it up with a boot. His material moves so fast, it's hard to keep track which is which, but that's Kodama in there. Incredible tandem offense there, and you can see Dasher Hatfield there observing. He's kind of in the outfield, so to speak. I think he's taking exception to the fact that... Sometimes uh, you got to sit in the mezzanine to get a good view of the game. You know more baseball stuff than I do. I know the Orioles are going all the way this year. Is that right? That's what I know. Inside the ring now, Mr. Touchdown having his trouble here with the teamwork of, Co of Oberian and Kodama. It's easy for me to say. Oh, had a handful of hair. Oh, but it was a handful of hair to Mr. Touchdown. It's good for the goose, it's good for the gander. Look, Dasher's angry. Dasher is, well, he's coaching. He's coaching from the sideline. No, I think he's frustrated. He doesn't like that Mr. Touchdown stole his thunder earlier when he wanted the baseball slide. And Chicago's got it right. Now, Mr. Hey, you're Mr. Sorry, Touchdown, Mr. Touchdown. Mr. Touchdown can be abrasive. He has an abrasive personality, and he needs to watch that. Woo! Throwbacks need to work as a team here. He pulled that neck breaker out of thin air. Teamwork is key in baseball, football, and pro wrestling. Mm -hmm. But not so much ping pong, I'd like to point out. Kodama now dragging Mr. Touchdown back to his partner, O'Barian. 
You cannot fault the tag team strategy of the Batiri here. They have really developed into a well-oiled machine during their tenure here at Chikara. They have become one of the premier teams here in Chikara. That's right, about a year and a half of experience teaming together here. Showed up in the autumn of 2010, if memory serves. They've tied him to the tree of woe. Mr. Touchdown in big trouble here. He is completely helpless. Oh, they're mocking Dasher Hatfield Dasher now. Dasher is still, yeah, Dasher is still sitting on the home run fence there. I don't know. Maybe if I'm for the slide into home. Maybe he's on. Maybe he's on the fence about whether he should help out or not. Here comes Dasher. Dasher did not like that one bit. One of Dasher's trademarks there. They were rounding the bases, albeit in their own bizarre fashion. Mr. Touchdown's up. Oh, the agility of Mr. Touchdown landing on his cleats, rolling back with a tag. Good game. Dasher with a two of double clothesline. Big tag on the keister. Now it's Dasher unloading. Kodama goes down. Downstairs on O'Barry, and he hooks him up. Whoa. Possibly going up for a suplex. Jackhammer by Dasher Hatfield. Right to the belly willy. Oh, uppercut with that un the underhand, underhand pitch. pitch. What's he got? He's got him up high. Now we're gonna see him run the bases. Are we gonna see it? And in the park, home run. Wait a minute. He's got both members of the Pateri now. One right into the other, right in the strike zone. It's time to round the bases, Dasher Hatfield. That one is out of here. He David. touches third, he comes into home. He's safe. Catching a cleat kick. He's looking for the suicide squeeze. Locks it in. He's got the hands locked all the way down hard. He nailed it. He hooks up that leg. Two, he's going to get him. No. No, O'Barian right there. Able to pull himself back together after that home run slide. Pre preventing that pinfall, preventing Kodama from getting pinned for the three count. Now Kodama with Mr. Touchdown. Oh, what a spine buster from a fireman's carry position. He hooks that leg. Is he going to get him? No. Mr. Touchdown has absorbed the majority of the physical punishment in this match. Not to discount the emotional and spiritual punishment, but the majority of the physical punishment. And while O'Barry in there, oh, he's trying to scale. He's got that. No, the DDT on the ring apron right there on the steel beams that surround the ring on the edge. He went head first by Quackenbush. Referee John Barber's got to be out there looking to see what happened to Dasher. Oh, right there. Barber's back was turned. Touchdown. Mr. Touchdown used his helmet. He nailed him with it. He nailed him with that giant football helmet. He's been watching the nasty boys. What was that? He hooks the leg. That's three. And look at this, Gavin. Look who's come to ringside to see Mr. Touchdown try That's Veronica right there to congratulate Mr. Touchdown. Surprise, surprise. There you have it, Chikara fans. A really big weekend coming up for the throwbacks and a big couple weeks coming up for the throwbacks, actually. And let's not forget about Sugar Dunkerton, Dasher Hatfield's original tag team partner in the throwbacks. He's been gone globetrotting for a little while, but he's found his way back to Chikara now. One can't help but wonder if these three are going to team up for King of Trios, which will be coming to Easton, PA on September 14th, 15th, and 16th. Get your tickets now at ChikaraPro.com. We'll see you back right here at the GoGo -Go next week. I'm Gavin.